Yeah, here we are, Via Lovad, a typical Sunday. Music blaring out of my shop. Sounds like cheap trick, huh? Yeah. Looks like we're running out of firewood too. Good thing springtime is here. Let's have a look inside the dark cave. Shop. That's where the noise is coming from. Oh, there's the new robot. And there's his daddy, a little bit chewed up. Let's go into the house. What do you say? Oh, look. Typical day here in the Rioja. The mountaintop's covered by some low-hanging clouds, but it's partly sunny. It's still a lot of light. Let's go inside where we're not so cooked through the fly screen and into the house. Well, here's the entrance. As you can see, you can see the second floor from here. You got typical old oak everything. Old oak beams, old oak steps, old oak handrail. One of the first furnishings I made here, this cabinet for the entrance. Oh look. That's pretty cool, isn't it? Makes the place look even dingier. <laughs> Here's my kitchen. Table's another thing I made. Didn't make the chairs though. Chairs are just too much work. Another shelf I made. And the oven stand, that, uh, that's another project of mine. You can see the cabinet covers. I know they're warped. See those are the good ones and those are the warped ones. The good ones are the warped ones reprocessed and the warped ones will be reprocessed later. This rotating shelf I got the idea from something I saw in Kevin's house sort of a way to to put pots and pans away but not have them out of reach and you got the clock I put a mirror there in the back so the kitchen looks deeper but it's not really any deeper and you got the the shelves I made why don't I turn the light off hi Nikki say hello to the camera Hello. Hello. Say hi, Grandma. Hi, Grandma. <laughs> Say hi, everybody. Hey, everybody. All right. See, my kid knows how to speak English. Isn't it wonderful? And with the lights on, you can see a little better. That's another good thing about putting the mirror in the back there. It sort of reflects all the light out of the kitchen window and helps to illuminate the kitchen. Okay. And into the dining room. The dining room, oh wait a second, I wanted to talk about these curtains. See, I put some curtains over this big entranceway to the dining room. Now this is in the same entranceway we saw before. You know, with the, the deep two-story thing, that's the front door. With the fly, with the fly and Peter, it doesn't really keep them from getting in, but it sort of blocks most of them out. And then behind the curtains, All very rustic. We got the the dining room. That lamp, that lamp there is one of my projects. As is the clock on the wall, which does want to focus. Well, there it is. And you got the living room. It's nice and shady in here during the day. In the summertime, it's wonderfully cool. In the winter time, if you keep the hearth going, well, she's plenty warm enough. And there's the captain's chair with the computer and stuff. You know me, I got to have my technology even when I'm in the country. My book collection. Well, my esoteric book collection. I sort of specialized here. 
Yeah, the fireplace, the eagle, you know, television with one ton of video. Oh, right, here's Amaya. Say hi, Amaya. Hi to me. No, say hi to everybody else. Ah, hi to everybody else. Oh, okay, thank you. Okay. Uh, hi 